Good morning, good morning, and welcome back to my channel. This is Christina, and let's cook fish for today. First recipe is sea bass, steam sea bass. So let's start. This recipe is super easy to prepare and quick for a uh, rush meals. So just clean fat dry the fish, season with salt and pepper, steam for 5 minutes, and after steaming, add a slice of spring onion and season with soy sauce and heat 2 to 3 tablespoons of oil and pour it over the steamed fish and our steamed sibas fish is done ready to serve kanin na lang ang kula preparing the second recipe halibut fish In this plate, 2 tablespoons of cornstarch, add salt and pepper, and mix it well. After that, clean and pat dry the fish before seasoning with salt and pepper, then coat with the cornstarch mixture properly. Yes, Papa Love, if hey, may tanong ako sa'yo. Sagot! Ano nga? Sabi ni Papa Love. Papa Lab, ano daw ang pinakaayaw na part sa isda ng mga iniwan? Tanungin mo ano? Ina. Edi tinik kasi tinik for granted sila eh. <laughs> Wala lang. Ano daw? Luto nga lang tayo. After that, heat a pan in a medium fire and add 1 tablespoon of butter. And stir fry the ginger slice until fragrant. Now, pan fry the halibut fish until golden brown in both sides. Remove the ginger slice so can, we can make now the sauce. So, the sauce is just 1 tablespoon of marine, the sweet sake. And just add soy sauce and sugar. Mix it and put the fish with the sauce. Halibut and marine sauce is done. Ready to serve. Prepare your rice. Let's eat. And this is our third recipe. It's a fish play. Yes. This is an easy recipe that you can do at home too with a handful recipe or ingredients. It's easy to cook. So just clean and pat dry the fish. After this, just cut the fish into pieces.
After cutting the fish, just add some fresh lemon juice. I use up just half of the lemon. And just mix it properly. Add salt and then mix it well again. Then just sit aside and now we are going to make the sauce so just mix up the two tablespoons of oyster sauce and one tablespoon of soy sauce and sugar and just mix it properly for later we'll use it up later now just transfer our marinated fish into a clean container kasi tumubig na po yung ating minarinate so tatanggalin natin siya sa pinagmarinate natin then we just add some uh, black pepper or white pepper then mix it well again then add 2 tablespoon of cornstarch and mix it properly. And here, just heat up a pan in a medium fire and add some oil, just enough to pan fry the fish. Because we are not going to deep fry, just pin fry. And just be careful and frying this fish because it's easily broken. This is so the fish fillet is so soft to pan fry. After frying it, just take it out and sit aside. We will make now the sauce. In same pan where we fry the fish, just add some oil or if there's enough oil, then just stir fry the sliced ginger and the sliced spring onion until fragrant before we are going to add the mixture of the sauce that we made while ago and just stir it up for a bit after that we just add the cooked fish and coat the fish with the sauce until chicken and that's it we're done cooking a fish fillet And always remember, a good recipe is useless if without heart in cooking. Happy tummy! And finally, this is our fish filet and soy sauce or oyster sauce. It's ready to eat and just prepare your rice this is so delicious and easy to prepare with a handful of ingredients now i'm serving you the fish fillet that we just made let's eat guys together happy tummy 
Thank you for watching and please don't forget to like, comment, and share. And please don't forget to on your notification bell for you to notified for my new uploads. Bye guys! Hanggang blay! See you in the next video!